Hello, my name is Marcel Bukmont. I'm Director of Product Management at Vico Software. In this level, so far I talked about the uh, compare and update, the reference browser, and the side-by-side -side drag and drop functionality uh, to help you uh, reuse existing content in your new projects. A very powerful fourth way to do the same thing is uh, an inline lookup tool uh, called Autocomplete, and I will demonstrate that in this video. In this video, we will first verify that we specified a reference project in the Project Settings view set. And then we will activate the Auto Complete mode in the Cost Planner view and copy content from the selected reference using the desired copy mode. With the project that you're going to work in open, select the Define Settings workflow item. Verify that you have selected a project that you want to use as a default reference for the current project. Next, open the Plan Cost view from the Workflow panel. By default, Autocomplete is disabled. To start using this automatic lookup function, enable From Project, From Reference, or both to either look up content in the current project or in the selected reference. I activate the From Reference option and I also select the desired copy mode. In this case I want to copy components with the defined formulas which is important if you are using a virtual warehouse, a collection of predefined components and model elements that are automatically connected when publishing the model to Vico Office, as will be explained in level 5. I'll enter the first three characters of an assembly code that I want to use. Cost Planner automatically lists the collection of assemblies and components that have a code that matches the three entered characters. The collection can be narrowed further by entering a fourth and a fifth character. To select the assembly or component that you want to insert into your cost plan, press the Enter button on your keyboard. The same approach works when I enter the first three characters in the description cell of a new row. For example, if I'm looking for a material with concrete in its name, I type CON and Cost Planner automatically shows me the assemblies and components that exist in the reference that I selected. Again, press Enter on your keyboard to copy the selected assembly or component. This session we first verified that we had a default reference selected in the Define Settings view set. Then we activated the Auto-Complete mode by selecting the From Reference option. We used the Auto-Complete to copy content from the selected reference and use the Include Formula copy mode to do this.